Hey everyone, we're gonna talk about all of the Paladin cards that were revealed for Whizbang's Workshop. Cool thing is, if we look at the factory tour map, we see that um, the Paladin section is in the game room and it's labeled as action figures and collectibles. And if you don't know me at all, um, that's one of my jams is collecting action figures and collectibles. And this is going to be super cool because I also like Paladin. It's one of my favorite classes. So let's get right into it. And thank you, Team 5, for putting all of the classes cards grouped together. So I'm not filming like a video with, with two or three cards and talking about it. I just like going through the classes and looking at it as an entirety. Um, so this is very cool. First card is Pipsy Paint Hoof, seven mana, four, four with Death Rattle. Summon a random Divine Shield, Rush, and Taunt Minion from your deck. So while we still don't have all of the cards yet, most of them, and we haven't talked about all the neutrals yet, I don't remember all the neutrals yet, this could be some busted stuff that we will see. Um, I haven't chosen what would be the best Divine Shield, Rush, or Taunt Minion, um, but there is some options out there. I'm excited for that. What I'm also excited about um, is the um, signature card. So supposedly, all of the signature cards are Dr. Boom versions, or Dr. Boomified, I think someone said. I think it was Hat. Um, versions of that card. They look amazing. I like even the background with the circles. Call that Kirby Crackle in uh, comics, if you will. I'm loving these and I'm excited to try to get as many as humanly possible. So let's go over to the next card. Uh, Toy Captain Tarim, five mana, three, seven. Uh, we know this character, if you will, calls back to Sunkeeper Tarim. And this one is Miniaturize, Taunt and Battle Cry. Set a minion's attack and health to this minion's. 3-7 um, is fine, no problem. Turning another minion into a 3-7, I think that would be something you would do on your side of the board. Just an idea. But it also comes with miniaturized. And the uh, mini is a smaller version, and it's a taunt and battle cry, one mana, one one, and it's set minions attack and health to this minions. So this one you would think that you would use against an opponent's minion. That's what I'm going to be looking to do. So I like this card as well. I always like Sunkeeper Tarim. Um, it's one of my favorite uh, legendaries when it came out. And this is a quite cool callback to that card. Uh, next up, Cardboard Golem. Four mana, four, four with Battle Cry. Increase the duration of auras in your hand, deck, and battlefield by one, which means... If the aura says last three turns, it's now going to last four turns. If it says it's two turns, it's going to last three turns. You understand that. And then um, this is everywhere. It's everywhere. Hand, deck, and battlefield. So no matter where it is, you'll be able to do that. The related aura cards right now is Crusader Aura. Uh, whenever a friendly minion attacks, give it plus two, plus one, and last three turns. This card is amazing. It's going to be even more amazing when it's four turns. Um, there's also Crafter's Aura, and we're going to talk about that. It's a new card. Seven mana holy spell. At the end of your turn, summon a random six cost minion, and this one lasts three turns. It also has Deputization Aura, which is your leftmost minion. It has plus three attack and lifesteal. That lasts three turns. This card, um, the full art for this card is just gorgeous. Um, also, Inventor's Aura. Your mechs cost one less, but it lasts two turns. I'm hoping I don't see that one. And then uh, Resistance Aura. Two mana holy spell your opponent's spells cost one more last two enemy turns this one's pretty good as well so this card's gonna be cool i like that the art is just amazing in it uh, it doesn't look like cardboard but I, I see it it works it works we like this one uh next up four mana flash sale summon a one two mech with divine shield and taunt give your minions plus one plus two so listen annoyatron is the one two mech I like Anoyatron. Um, I think it's bad that we have Anoyatron as a flash sale. What are we doing? This is who wants to who who thinks that um, Anoyatron is going to be a um, a character that's in a flash sale? Forget about it. Summon a one two mech with divine shield and taunt. Give your minions plus one plus two. Depending what's on the board, this could be pretty broken. Uh, next up, Crafter's Orb. We already talked about it. Seven mana, holy spell at the end of the turn. Summon a random six cost minion. Last three turns. Um, you know how random we get here. There could be some really fun stuff that pops off with those summoned cards. Now, if they stay on the board, we don't know yet. So 
interesting to see. I'm excited to play this, and the art is just amazing. Uh, next up, and this is one of my favorite looking pieces of card art ever, and I'm going to craft this golden day one just because it's really cool. It's a six mana wind up enforcer, uh, enforcer three five tradable. Battle cry summon one copy of this minion, and you trade to upgrade. This is my favorite card of the class so far um, out of all of them. Like I said, the art is amazing. I like the fact that it's tradable so you could summon more if you don't need it right now. Um, this is something that you could keep in hand if or won't be upset about if it gets in your um, your opening hand for the mulligan because you could just trade it and then just have something to use later on. So I like this one. The utility in this is probably going to be pretty good. Whether or not you know any of these minions stick, we don't know yet. But anyway, uh, next up is three mana two three trinket artist battle cry. Draw a divine shield minion and an aura. And we've already went over the auras. So whatever divine shield minions that you have um, in your deck, and then one of these auras, you'll be able to pop off. This is a cool card. I like the art. Um, it's just there's no complaints here. Uh, next up, four mana, two, three, Painter's Virtue. I like that it is a paintbrush with a holy hammer. Lifesteal. After your hero attacks, give minions in your hand, plus one, plus one. I like this. Um, besides the fact that you can use it um, three times unless somebody destroys it, um, it also gives you a little bit of health with lifesteal and then just buffs up whatever minions are in your hand. So this is a good one very interesting to see this being played absolutely uh next up this one came out pretty pretty early on in the uh expansion discussion uh this is a three three two beast tigress plushie miniaturized rush lifesteal divine shield look at how cool that artwork is it's amazing and then the mini is obviously a one mana one one with rush lifesteal and divine shield this is a really cool card i like this um it's not a low it's not a, a, a large cost for this um and it's really cool art it's a rush lifesteal divine shield and it's a three two you also have the miniature eyes i'm a fan of this card as well and then last up another cool really awesome um, card art is uh, one mana fancy packaging give a minion with divine shield plus two plus three I like this I'm going to be interested to see what the uh, golden animation looks like for this card as well it's amazing although the whole packaging thing if I have an action figure I would want to open up the action figure um, especially an action figure as cool as that one so that's it. Hope you liked the reveals. Let me know if you're looking forward to any of these cards. Let me know if you're not looking forward to playing against these cards. And I'm going to keep on revealing all of the uh, class cards as I can. I think we just got all of Shamans. We have Druids. We have the Neutrals. I'll probably do the Neutrals last. But I'm very excited for this set. Comes out in just a few weeks. Don't forget... Like I've been saying for the past couple of weeks, I've got a giveaway that I'm doing for the WizBangs Workshop regular bundle. I will put a link in the description below, and I will see you all in the tavern.